Seven points in three places worse off than their hosts at kickoff. As they were in need of a victory away to Rennes to rubber stamp their league and status. Six games without defeat had seen Philip Montagnes Rennes flying to the top half of the table in recent weeks and looking to finish the season strongly. And Rennes expected to have to try and beat PSG Loni Alphonse Erora, but not Mathieu Pébernay. Two terrific blocks off the line from the defender. And finally, the goalkeeper earning his keep. Oh, Ola Tovenen with a beautiful little flick. Pébernais wouldn't give up. Abdoulaye de Curé couldn't beat Abbasia number 17 either. The claims for handball ignored by the referee. Bastia earning some of their own luck. Well, there wasn't so much luck just minutes before the break. Francois Camano, who'd only been booked eight minutes before, sent off for the first time in the 19-year-old's career. Poor challenge on Paul-Georges Ntep. Two occasions seeing him take an early bath. Well, Bastia up against it for the second half. They'd won their two meetings with Rennes this season in League and Cup but hadn't won away to Rennes since 2003. Montagnier would hopefully have his side make advantage of their one-man advantage. Ball coming off the post from Peto Henrik after Rola had saved from Tovenen. But they had the perfect opportunity to finally take the lead. Guillaume Gillet penalised for this blatant handball. And the cross from Sheikh Mbengu. Ntep stepped up. A brilliant save. Oriola. Not wanting to be beaten. Pammed it away. And got the congratulations of his teammates. Ukraine were becoming very frustrated. Tovenin scored the winner in their last home match against Gangong. The Swedish striker this time denied by the post. Frustration building for the Brittany club and that would only be worse when Bastia grabbed all three points late on five minutes from time Gail Danik cutting inside and beating Benoit Costil at his near post terrific finish from the 33 year old former Rennes player first goal since arriving from Lyon well, Bastia had got over a six match winless streak including defeat to PSG in the Coupe de Ligue final to record back-to-back -back wins. And this strike putting them on course for three consecutive wins. Krenn couldn't find a response. Boos from the stands, but delight for the Corsicans. The victory confirming their presence in Ligue 1 for next season.